Alright guys, so I am back once again doing another frustration series. Oh, why did I drink that quick revive? Oh my god. So, I've decided that I guess, I guess I'll play some Die Rise because I think that's what the spirit wants me to do. I'm, I'm not sure what happened after I went, no, he kind of just disappeared. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna get started here. I have a drink. Well, a drink I like to call Rip It. It's a healthier version of Monster. It doesn't have quite as much taurine. Why are you doing this? Why me? Travel where? Don't you get it? The heck? I've never, I've never played this solo before. What? What do you mean, man? Wow. If you're gonna talk to your imaginary friends, Stu, you might want to wait till you're in a Z-free zone. All right, screw this. Let's just play the stupid game. It's not a stupid game, but oh my god, it's gonna be so frustrating. Now, if you've been uh, Man, watching other people playing games, situation. well, I gotta turn this down a little bit. Oh, the phone! Who is it? I don't think it's important. So, um, yeah, let's just ignore the phone. Um, if you've been watching people on YouTube play Die Rise, you probably noticed that they like to stay up here and uh, get points that way, build the tramp. I don't do that. I usually just turn on the power as soon as I can. And I'll get a key, of course. I'm going to go down right now. Actually, yeah, you know what? I'll stay up here for a round just because. Just because I can. Oh. All right. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know why people like to stay up here. I just think it's really it's a hassle to not have the power on, and to not be able to get your perks right away. And I'd like to build the soliquifier as soon as possible. Uh, I mean, while of course I love the trample steam, I I love the soliquifier too, and it's easier to build. So I like to build that first, that simply because it's it's easier. We're gonna build the key. I don't know how we. How, I don't know how it took him so long to insert a key, but you know, video games. That's just the way they work. Alright, one round down. Hopefully, not so much more to go. Because I'm not excited to be playing this. I mean, I love this game, absolutely. It's just, it makes me so mad. It makes me so frustrated. We got some Mule Kick, we got some Pack-a-Punch. Those are perks I definitely don't want there. What the hey? Why do you gotta put them there, huh? Hmm? 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 Did you? Did you? Did you? Alrighty. Let's start building this thing. No. Duh. I love the sound effects. I know people have been saying that they prefer the, the zombie, the, I'm sorry, they prefer the players from Black Ops 1. I prefer from Black, Black Ops 2 simply because that's, that's where I started playing zombies. I didn't really play zombies in Black Ops 1. I'm not much of a Call of Duty person aside from zombies. This is about the only game mode that I really enjoy to play by myself and with friends. Um, but yeah, I missed the door. And that one's still here, so that's okay. I lo completely lost my train of thought. I'm sorry. Come on. Sorry, I gotta just adjust something. Okay. So if you like this new angle, where you just see the couch and myself, uh, let me know. I think I'm gonna do this for the rest of the series. And for future series, I think this is uh, a pretty decent camera angle. I'll keep it for a while. I mean, I always say, yeah, I like this camera angle. I'm going to keep it. But I always change it like every series. This one I really do like, though. Even though I've already said that before. I know it's hard to believe. Kind of like lying, but... Yeah. yeah. I really should be focusing on this game. There are so many freaking times. I'm sure you've all done this. You think you run far enough, but you don't, and you die. And it's a game over. That's so unfair. I mean, seriously, that is so ridiculously unfair. Then you should get like a second chance. You should you should be able to like I don't know. I don't like how you just die completely. Wow. And I hope y'all are enjoying the HD graphics because this capture card cost me $160. Freaking or $150 or something. It was a lot. So I hope you guys are enjoying it. Um yeah, alright. Got 
myself a ping pong paddle. Gonna go down the sofa, gonna take the little tricky dicky path. Wow! What is that? Dude, I freaking okay. I want to rematch. I want to rematch with this stage. Oh my god. It's alright. It's alright. I'm calm. I'll be patient for a while. For a while, anyway. Not for that long. But I will be. I'll be patient for a little bit. But I haven't played this in at least a week or so. So, all right. Come on. Let's just get this over with. Man, I really need a haircut. Pretty good. Uh -huh. I don't understand. Why do I even have to watch this? You know, when I when I first was watching gameplay of this on YouTube, I was watching Syndicate. I'm sure a lot of you know who Syndicate is, if you watch a lot of YouTube stuff. And I thought this was going to show up when I played with my friend, and it didn't. So I'm like, oh, this is an Xbox 360 exclu exclusive, of course. Like I didn't realize it was just a solo power. play exclusive, Again. and there are no pieces up here. That's great. There's nothing. Man, I really, man, I have really lost my touch of being able to focus and commentate. You will hear me, and you shall listen. Fetch me their souls. So the day this is being shot, Mob of the Dead DLC pack just came out yesterday, so it's 17th finished. of April. Now, what the hell is it? And I really want to know what that purgatory mode is. If you guys know what it is by the time this is released, tell me. Because since I own a PS3, by the time this comes out, Mob of, Mob of the Dead probably still won't be available to me. Because I don't want to pay money for online. That's dumb. I don't like that. You know what? I don't like you either. Oh. Okay. Aww. All right. Come on, please give me some jug at the front. There it is. Yeah, jug. And pack punch. All right. Six, floor 57, Heinz ketchup, floor 58, floor 59, floor 60, floor 61, floor 62, and 463, floor 64, floor 65, and 666. Number of the Beast, Iron Maiden. That's where it comes from. The hell am I talking about? Uh, oh, oh my god. I can't believe I. What? Okay, I'm not... I'm focusing for real now. I, I have been focusing, but... Oh my god! I swear I'm not bad at this game. I've gotten to round 32, I think. 30. I got to round 32 before. Come on. Come on, game! This is a revolutionary console. Load fast! Use that RAM power! Speaking of RAM power... PS4, 8 gigs of RAM. Holy crap, that is a lot of freaking RAM for a console. I don't you know, I don't think I'll even get a PS4. Or uh, the next box, whatever it's going to be called. Because, I mean, I'm just... By the time they come out, I will fully... Hopefully, I'll be in my career. Much deeper down the road, I'll actually... I'll uh, be getting paid to make films and whatnot, so I don't even know if I'll have time to play video games and stuff. Alright, sick ping pong paddle. And besides, the next box, always online. Now I know that, that's. Ugh, that's so stupid. Always online, always online. That's, that's the dumbest concept ever. If you're gonna make a revolutionary console, 
Why would you dumb down the console so it can't play online and offline? 